Rationals application question. I tried solving this by keep getting a different answer than what's on the textbook. So here's the question. When we have two resistors S and T are connected in parallel, their combined resistance, capital R, is given by the equation 1 over R is equal to 1 over S plus 1 over T. And the question says if S is increased by one unit and T is decreased by one unit, then we would like to know the change in R. So here's the deal. To find the change in R, it's always going to be the new minus the old. But before we can say that, let's just isolate R from this equation first. To do so, let's combine the fractions here. Right here, I need to multiply T and T to get the common denominator. Right? And then right here, multiply S and S. All right, then we will get 1 over R that's equal to. The denominator is just ST. And then right here is just t, and then plus here is s. But not done yet, because the r is on the bottom. So we will have to do the reciprocal on both sides. So here we have r equals st on the top over t plus s. Now, to find the change in r, this is all we have to do. Again, it's going to be the new minus o minus the old or the original perhaps sounds better like that so what is the new r well s is increased by one so here we will have to say s plus one then t is decreased by one so t minus one and then do the rest right so over t is t minus one and then plus s is s plus 1. Construction, right? Anyway, right here, minus, the original is just that. So here we have t plus s, and then the numerator is st. So here's the deal. I'm just going to distribute the top, and you will see that this is just st, and then this is just going to be minus s, and then this is going to be plus t, and then this is going to be minus 1. And then right here you will see that the denominator is actually really nice, because this is just t minus 1 plus s plus 1, and uh, minus 1 plus 1 just cancel. So this first fraction here has t plus 1 for the denominator, likewise for that. So in fact we can put it in a big fraction already. So t plus s and then right here we have that minus st so as you can see here we have the st minus st so they cancel and the rest is just the answer so finally the answer is just negative s plus t minus 1 over t plus s and this right here will do it so this is an application of rational expressions and best of luck in your class.